Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I know in my last video I said I was going to upload regularly and then I haven't, so I'm going to stop making promises. Um, but in today's video I'm going to do a vlog of just me pottering around the house doing different things. We finally have a moving date. What is this life? I am so happy. After our offer being accepted for the house in March, we now have a moving date of the 27th of October, which as I'm filming this is two weeks today. So I'm very, very happy and I'm just, everything's crossed because our mortgage offer expires. It's very soon. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say, very, very soon. So fingers crossed that all comes together. Anyway, thought I'd start off with another little haul. I know I did a haul in the last video of baby clothes. This haul's a little bit more practical things. It's not a big haul, it's just stuff that's sat on the side waiting to be packed up to be moved. So I just thought I'd do that first. Say hello and welcome and everything else. And then just get started with the vlog really. I don't have much planned for today. It's now half 11. I've just got back from my 28 week midwife appointment, which is mad. I'm in the third trimester, like what? And I heard her heartbeat again so i heard it at 25 weeks and then we heard it today so i'm going to play it my sister recorded it because she came with me it's just a heartbeat it probably means nothing to anyone else but it was exciting for me anyway so yeah just got back from that everything was good they started measuring her today so they said she's measuring perfect so Yep, they took some bloods and all is good. So feel positive about that. I've got another appointment for three weeks time and then another one for three weeks after that. And then it's every two weeks from then, which is mad. I'm somehow out of breath now. Anyway, back to the little haul that I'm gonna show you. Yeah, like I said, quite practical things. And you might be thinking, why are you buying that now? But I just want to be prepared. And I feel like as I see stuff, I'm just gonna buy it. So recently my TikToks have all been like packing my hospital bag. So <laughs> I have started buying stuff <laughs> for that basically. So Amazon have just had their Amazon Prime Day deal thing. Like the two days where things are like on offers. First thing I got was an electric double breast, breast, electric double breast pump. This was $44.99 on the offer but i don't even think this was included in the prime deal but i just got it anyway it's had really good reviews and i just thought yeah i'm gonna get it then the other thing on amazon were some i think there's 12 but they are reusable breast pads they are bamboo ones and i can't i'll try and leave the price on the screen how many is in here but it comes in like this little mesh bag and i was told off tiktok that the just the reusable ones are better because the disposable ones stick to your sore boobs so we've gone for the reusable but the breast pads that come with this pump um are disposable so i will have some disposable ones as well but and then from boots i got this frida mom upside down peri bottle this is something else i've seen on tiktok a lot um of cleansing down there um when you've had the baby so got that which is probably just a lot of money for a bottle but it is what it is and then i got the classic spritz for bits this was a lot of money but again heard great things and the other thing i bought yesterday was the is it baby coco or rochelle's baby brand um the nipple balm but i've got that in the bedroom because i already need that which is a bit tmi but here we are and then and home bargains da, 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 da. not baby related you'll probably be like thank god that is not baby related because all you ever do is bang on about a baby but um spiced gingerbread and i love like the decoration on it i love gingerbread candles i have one burning now like I'm obsessed with gingerbread all year round, but oh my god, I love it. And that was like 2 99 which is enough said, amazing. My most exciting thing, which only arrived this morning, 
This is the changing mat. This is the Mama Shack changing mat. And it's an anti-roll one because I saw, again, people saying the anti-roll is better. So it's kind of like, oh, I don't know if you can see, like curves up um, at the sides. And this is the, oh, it's got waterproof and wipe clean suitable from birth made in the uk this is the i think it's rose spotty like pattern anyway that is the little haul for today there is 12 weeks until this baby now there's two weeks till we move 12 weeks till the baby all systems go i really wanted this video to be productive and for me to do a lot of stuff around the house like moving preparing the house but you know what i have no energy right now so we might have to hold that thought for a while um, while I try and sum up some energy because currently there's, there's, there's zero energy. Got a new jumper as well. This could be in my haul. My haul? It says London on it and I got it in Hollister the other day in the sale for £15 down from 35 and oh my god. I love when this happens. So it said £35 and it was re reduced to 22 or 24 I was like, okay, I love it. I want it. I don't really have lots of things like this and it fits the bump, which is bumping now. So I was like, yeah. Also, I've worn this like the past three days. Disgusting, I know, but it's so comfy. Took it to the till, £15. So I feel like I really won with this jumper and I'm going to get so much use out of it like pregnancy post-pregnancy like it's great love it anyway i'm gonna go right i'm gonna do something that i've been putting off for ages well i kind of made a start with and then yeah and i'm now procrastinating and i should just do it so i'm gonna show you oh my this lighting i'm so sorry it's very very yellow but anyway it's this oh my god i look i feel so rough and look so rough today but it is this wall so it was filled as you can see to about here with pictures i've got loads off already but i still have these to take off and get the blue tack off then i'm going to sand the wall and paint it white again i'm so out of breath but i just need to hurry up and like actually finish getting the rest off because i've done all that i just need to actually finish it so i'm going to do that today and just get it over with um so cue the time lapse alexa no, you're not called Black, so which one are you? <clears throat> Ziggy, play Smooth Radio. Smooth North Wales and Cheshire from Bradley's Global Player. So I have now finished that wall. Oh my god, it took a lot less time than I thought. 
originally I was doing it without the scraper and it was taking like five minutes per photo to take the photo off and then get all the blue tack off so I'm so glad I just got a scraper and did it because it probably took like half an hour just over half an hour to do the whole wall so so happy but now I feel like death and it's mad because if I wasn't pregnant and I know I do know I'm banging on about being pregnant now but like I feel exhausted I feel like sick um I've got a cold anyway so it's really not helping things but like I just feel like I have no energy and after I did the wall we've got quite a few dishes so I wanted to like wash up and everything and I just feel like my body is just telling me to sleep and I'm like wants to shut down and it's really not fun because I'm not even like at the end of my pregnancy like I still got work I've still got my 13 hour shifts at work to do <laughs> like and I know it's because I'm not well like I would normally be a bit better than this but yeah like I didn't think that would take it out of me as much as it has like I don't feel very good now but I am just gonna chill watch a bit of telly do some crisscrosses when we're on holiday I bought this book because I don't love oh sorry that's my disgusting fan because I'm so hot as well all the time we have literally a fan on either side of the bed but when we're on holiday I bought this well for the holiday I bought this crisscross book and oh my god I've been obsessed because I don't really read and I get bored and I like to kind of oh I like to um like people watch on holiday as well um which sounds weird when you start around a pool people watching but <laughs> hopefully it doesn't sound too weird um so I just like a crisscross so I'm gonna do some crisscross now do you know what I feel like such an old woman like I'm listening to smooth do my crisscross but yeah just I feel happy that I've done the wall but it's quarter to one and I don't know I just feel like this this is how I feel like this is a visual representation yeah anyway I'll catch up with you later it's now 20 to 3 and I'm feeling a bit hungry now so I'm gonna have something to eat. I actually went for breakfast with my sister this morning before the midwife appointment so I wasn't like hungry or anything um, but I am a little bit peckish now. So I'm also trying to use up everything that is in the freezer. I'm so sorry about the, the light. Um, so I think I've decided, I think I could have one of these. Basically, in the next couple of weeks, we're not going to be that healthy because we're just using like freezer stuff up, which probably isn't the healthiest of stuff. But I've got these turkey quarter pounders, which I think I'm going to have in a wrap. So I'm just going to pop that in the air fryer. And then I'm going to do the washing up so you can enjoy that. But I don't know how much more I'm actually going to film today because I'm, I'm just like watching YouTube and like doing my crisscross. <laughs> which is so not exciting but I'm just exhausted so I've told myself I'm gonna get up put my food in the air fryer and while it's cooking I'm gonna do the washing up these are what I'm having and
So the dishes are done, I've cleaned the hob as well and I've started getting this together for moving, just things that like we'll need when we get there and here's the turkey quarter pounder. Yes, I just have it on its own with my favourite Helms ketchup, <laughs> so health. There definitely should be something quite green in there but there isn't so... <laughs> I think I broke my um, thingy. I'm gonna talk that in a sec. Anyway, my camera is flashing at me red. So I'm actually gonna end the video here because I'm just gonna have my lunch and carry on doing my crisscross on YouTube. So it's not gonna be that exciting. I'm really sorry if this vlog was a bit of a fail and not that exciting, but it was nice to catch up nonetheless. So I'm gonna go. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you hopefully very, very soon. Goodbye.